Ukraine's harvest becomes the new battlefield. Across Ukraine, in the shimmering heat, one side is become familiar this summer. Combined harvesters sweeping across fields of grain, in a race against fast spreading fires. The conflict's front lines straddle some of Ukraine's richest farmland. Whether caused by accidents or intention, the fires darkening the summer sky are eating into a harvest that was always going to be tough to collect and even tougher to export. Pavlo Serienko is in the crosshairs of this battle. The 24-year-old man is the third generation of his family to run a farm in the Vasilivka district of Zaporizhia. Since his father died from coronavirus, Serienko is managing the 3,000 hectare farm on his own. But nearly half the land is now too dangerous to cultivate, he said. We can't even get there. It's either mined or near the occupied territories literally the front line. We had occupiers on part of the fields. Serienko has literally seen his family's business go up in smoke. He said in the past few days he had lost 30 hectares of wheat and 55 hectares of barley. In those 1,200 hectares I can't reach are also burning. What can I do? I won't even go there. The sowing season was just as dangerous. We sowed a field of 40 hectares. We had to leave the field four times to finish it. Every time we left, they shelled the place instantly. Once, there were 23 motor hits. His buildings and equipment have also been hit. The animal farm and all the warehouses built over the past 20 years were destroyed. The planter was crushed. The winter workshop where we repaired tractors and combines was also smashed. There are hundreds of farmers in a similar plight. Many likely face bankruptcy. That's it for today. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.